Eternal Goddess Hestia, Goddess of Home and Hearth, thank you for blessing us and our family, making this house a home. Hail and blesses you, Re Goddess. What is up, guys? So I decided to do a video of honoring the gods in our daily lives. And in this video, I'm going to show you how I honor the goddess Hestia. And how I like to honor her is not only keep a good home, but I also honor her through my cooking as well. And it was actually through trying to honor her and trying something new that I actually discovered that I can actually cook. And that's just not me saying that, but friends, I've cooked for friends and people especially love my baked stuff. So we're going to look at my cookbook and see how I honor the goddess through cooking for the family. Anyway, that's what it is up, guys. So this is the Pickering Family Cookbook. And what is inside of here are all of the recipes of what we like to usually cook. So we put them all in this book. And none other than Hestia is in, on the inside of the cover. So even in the cookbook, I like to honor her. And you guys see that? And in particular, I always like to do Greek recipes in honor of the gods. So you'll see a lot of Greek recipes in here. <laughs> I'm not going to show so Greek and Greek. So I'm not going to show you like a cooking lesson or anything. I'm just letting you guys see some of the stuff. So you see, as I said, that a lot of it has to do with Greek. Because, and some not, but it, the Greek stuff is mainly in honor of the gods. But yeah, it's just a regular cookbook. And like I've mentioned before, I've uh, discovered that I actually have a talent for cooking because I wanted to try something new to honor the gods with. And I know that Hestia is over the home and hearth. So I was like, you know what, let's try our hand at this. And through that, I found out that I like cooking. Who would have thought, you know? <laughs> so yeah, so whatever god you're close to or goddess you're close to, just try something new, and you may uh, discover that you have a really good talent for it. So, it's really cool. So, with that said, I, all, I made these right here. So, they are Greek honey cookies, is what this is. And I'm trying to decide right now if I should put walnuts on them or not, so... I'm gonna actually try try them with walnuts first and decide if you wanna know why these have walnuts and then these don't. So, yep, so these are Greek honey cookies. So like I was saying about how I usually like to honor the gods through Greek inspired foods. Here's an example right here. That's honey, by the way. That's not like grease or anything. All right. And no pun intended by saying that's not grease. Anyway, oh, and another cool thing here you go. Another cool thing is that honoring Hestia through baking and cooking, I can then make things to honor the gods with. Like this in particular, I'm going to give the first one to Aphrodite because it's a sweet cookie and I'm going to offer that to her in an offering that I'll probably do another video for. So I'll let you guys see that. So yeah, you, you just never know. And if it wasn't for the gods and me, just basically just for for the gods. I never would have known about uh, me enjoying cooking so much. So yeah, these things have to like soak in honey. So I like do that. Get some of the honey on there. You guys want one? Anyway, I'll talk to you later guys. Go with the gods and I'll see ya. Bye.